Hello everyone, welcome to another Jimmy A Plays, and let's resume the Legend of Zelda series. Um, hope you enjoyed my Wind Waker playthrough, my Twilight Princess playthrough, which you can check it out on my channel, it's up there. Today I'm going to start up the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD, being put up on my Nintendo Switch. Uh, originally released on the Wii, I, did, I do own the copy of the Wii, the Wii version. I did beat it on the Wii when it first came out, but I haven't played it since they released it for the Switch, so... All those years that went by, I never really played Skyward Sword. Oops, that's annoying part. I did do a file. Not that Jimmy A. The game's a really long game. I'm just gonna go with Jimmy. To avoid confusion, because that was my file when I first played it. I never finished that file either. I do not own the player's guide for this game yet. I may get it at some point this this uh, playthrough. Um, bear with me on that. I may have to go online and look at some shit to, to beat. My main goal here is just to beat the game. I'm not going to try to go balls to the wall with um, unlocking everything. Like the, My first file in this game, I was trying to do that. I'm not going to do that here. I just want to beat it. First thing I'm going to do is turn the vibration off my controller because I hate when my controller vibrates. Nintendo presents what? The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. So just like Twilight Princess, this game starts off incredibly slow. It's painful slow. That's how bad it is. But it's a really good Zelda game which you get past like the first hour or so. Oh, those kids just killed themselves. Oh, here comes a musical copyright strike. Sorry, YouTube. Trying. There we are, boys. Jimmy. Run, Jimmy, run! Rise, Jimmy. The time has come for you to awaken. The time has come. The time is now. You are fated to have a hand in a great destiny, and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. Jimmy! I wish I could awaken from a sleep that I could actually sleep. I do not remember much of that dream part. The only thing I remember is that it takes forever to get off the fucking island. A lot of bullshit, boys. What the fuck is that thing? <laughs> well, Jimmy, get up, buddy. Hey, sleepyhead, I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? I guess. Rise and shine, Jimmy. Today's the wing ceremony. You promised to meet me before it starts. Remember? You better not keep me waiting. Forever yours, Zelda. So let me start off by saying, this game is much better being played on the Nintendo Switch, in my book. It is so much better to play Skyward Sword with an actual gaming controller, and not the Wii uh, remote. The 
The only thing bad about this is that it's a little awkward to use still. Oh, I can't turn vibration off? Okay, I guess I can't turn the vibration off my controller. Maybe I missed it, I don't know. Hold L. Oh, this that's L button, okay. That's a little awkward to get used to. Jimmy! If you're heading over to the plaza, the quickest way is uh, out the door to the ground floor. The exit on the top floor is still locked, so we obviously can't get out there. What's taking the lunch lady so long? What am I bored with her later? Relax, Pip. <laughs> Good morning, Jimmy. Today's a big wing ceremony, right? I went to fly too, but I, I didn't make the cut, so I'm stuck back here at the academy. Plus, I gotta move these barrels over to the kitchen. I was hoping to at least be able to cheer you on, Jimmy, but I guess that's the way it goes. Go out there and, and wow them, buddy. Thanks, bro. Wait, how do I throw it? No, I'm gonna throw it and break it. Here, move out of the way, I'll help you out. Oh, wow. I'm so strong. Set it down and rest if you have to. Yo, old lady, what do you want to say? What's all this? I told Flash to carry that. Ah, probably for the best. That skinny boy would have gotten. He probably have gotten flattened. Say, don't you have something important? Or some important ceremony or some to, or some such today? Hmm. Well, thanks for the help. Thanks for the rubies you never gave me. Alright, bro, I'm gonna carry this for you too. Do rosy red cheeks. I don't have to get anything. You know, I really wanted to wait to do this uh, Let's Play until I get the player's guide. Uh, but I just never ordered it yet. I would like to get it next, although I don't really need it. I didn't need it for Wind Waker, I didn't need it for Twilight Princess. The only thing on Wind Waker that I really used the guide for was um, uh, for the Triforce Shards, but you can always go online and look that shit up. Thanks, that was a huge help, Jimmy. I know it's not much, parents have to pay the old lady offering me to do. That lady gave you, is offering you 40 rubies? I have to hang back and watch the academy today. Good luck with the ceremony, Jimmy. Dude, you're like six feet tall and you can't pick up that fucking barrel. Slow start. Well, here's your hometown, Skyloft, so. You will be coming back here a lot. Here is the save points. Yeah, I was gonna stay with that other file. But no, that's fine. I usually never use I usually use my real name for those for the Ah shit, sorry, I'm watching some of the phone. Hey Jimmy up here! Good morning to you, Jimmy. Today's finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered. That's something I'd like to ask you about. Talk to me and we can have a quick chat. Why? Excellent. Always remember, you can target someone to talk to them easily. And even when there isn't anything to target, it's a convenient way to quickly face your view forward. 
Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on the conversation from this distance. Why don't you come up here and join me? You should be able to climb up that, that uh, you should be able to climb up if you dash up top, top of that wooden box, don't you think? I think you can make that jump fairly easy. Try climbing up here. Okay, so I get... It's gonna take a little while to get used to these controls, but there's been a few months since I last played this game. I actually don't remember getting it. It could have been like a year or so. Was it last summer? I don't remember. No. Two summers ago, it has to be. So, what are you up to? Rushing to get to some last minute bird riding practice in, in this morning, Jimmy? Oh. You have someone to meet? Ah, Zelda's waiting for you, isn't she? Perfect timing then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster, Gapora, has a pet named Mia. And, well, she scampered off again. Look. Over there, you see her? The headmaster's so busy working with Zelda, prep, uh, prep, uh, preparing for the ceremony. So then maybe I should feed her, but the ceremony's about to start and I just put on a fresh set of clothes and well, you see, you don't want cat hair on it. I'll get the fucking cat for you, don't worry. Fantastic, so you'll do it then. I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate you taking the time to help. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there if you hang off the ledge or you can climb onto that roof from the other side. I'm terribly sorry. Uh, I, but I know you're quite the climber. I really appreciate it. So first off, that guy looks like that village uh, elder, or the village shaman, whatever the fuck his name is, in uh, Twilight Princess. And secondly, as I was saying earlier, I like, when I'm doing a casual playthrough, I don't use my online name. I, I'm a little surprised I used Jimmy A right there. So now I feel like this whole Let's Play is ruined. <laughs> and third third off, um, I knew Amiya once before, long ago. She was not someone who was uh, someone I really like anymore. Oh, can I throw the cat? Holy shit. There you go. Nice work. You brought her back safe and sound. That's not a fucking cat. That's a squirrel. What the fuck is that, a rabbit? Sorry for troubling you with this. I know you're busy, Jimmy. I suppose I should feed Mia now. Please tell the headmaster that we are found his pet. He should be up by the statue of the goddess. And I'm sorry, guys. My nose is a little stuffy. I believe Zelda is there with him. You should hurry along. Oh, yes, I should give you rewards. Not much, but please take this. Just don't tell the others. Yeah, give me your fucking money. I'll take it all. My nose is a little stuffy. Um... It comes and goes, man. Half hour from now, it could be fine. Who the hell knows? <sighs> I'll save it. I'm gonna save and save often, although it doesn't really matter in case I lose power from the time of switch. But that's stamina fruit. Make sure you get that. It fills your stamina up right away. Yeah, this week been brown a little bit of a cold, I guess. Change of the seasons. Princess Zelda, you so fine. Oh, youth. Guided by the servant, I apologize for the musical copyright strikes. I'm not gonna sing Zelda's song, you guys can sing it. Hey, good morning, Jimmy. Oh, Zelda, you're looking fine today. I'm glad to see my loft room got you out of bed. I was pretty sure you sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. I wish I could fucking sleep in like a normal fucking person. <laughs> Look at this instrument. Look at this outfit. They're mine to use today in the ceremony since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Ooh, you can be my goddess any day you want, babe. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it's just like the one of the one uh, the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous too. I asked father about it, and he says it's called a harp. A Bryce Harper, okay. And look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself, and we get to use it in today's ceremony. Between the harp and this outfit, I'm gonna make a great goddess today. 
I got you up early this morning because I wanted to be the first, uh... I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Jimmy. I mean, she wants it. You better give it to her, Jimmy. Uh, so how do I look? Uh... Great. Great, lady. Ha! I think so too, but it's nice to know that you agree. Thanks, Jimmy. Jimmy A looks like such a, such a doofus in this game. Ah, oh, there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, uh, hello, Father. Ah, Jimmy, you're here too. Outstanding. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. I thought today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for once. How the fuck do you guys sleep like normal people? That's unbelievable. I struggle to fall asleep every fucking night. If you win today's ceremonial race, you get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda, so give it, so give it your best out there. Uh, yes, about that. Father, I don't know if he can do it. Recently, Jimmy hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. Ah, oh, where did Thorman leave the bus, you goddamn hoo -ah. And even when he's out riding his loft wing, he's just lazily gliding around, probably daydreaming. I don't know what he's thinking. He's gonna have to be perfect control of his bird to win today. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Though you may have a point. Today's wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond to his bird. Victory will not come easily. And, as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. Now, where are you the bus, you goddamn bitch? You see, Jimmy and his cough ring share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is, uh, but a half of a pair. We are only made by a whole, by a whole loft wings. Um, the guardian birds that the goddess has bestowed upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. The, the beginning is so fucking long. If you think this is bad, wait till like fucking ten minutes from now. When we are young, every one of us meets our uh, loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. And it's quite a big moment, I'm sure you will call. Ah, but at my first meeting between Jim and his loft wing was extraordinary. Splendid! The bird that came to him is a crimson loft wing. And it was a bird so rare, rare that we sh were we sure for some time that it had vanished from the mind. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. I hate birds. I like cats. Right, kitty? <coughs> meow, meow, meow. Oh, her ear twitched. Do you recall when Jimmy and the loft wing of his first met? Fuck the Mets. What a sight. The little boy just hoped, hopped on that uh, bird and gracefully flew away without every mo or even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging by how jealous you were that day, I say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. Now you judgmental fucking little twat, Zelda. Let's crack my finger, boys. Where's my bird? Ah, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the only one envious of the power, powerful bond shared by Jimmy and his bird. Anyone who's a part of something special is bound to catch some nasty looks sooner or later. Ho ho! Santa! <laughs> this contest is nothing to laugh at, Father. The ceremony is part of the final test for those trained to become Knights of Skyloft. If Jimmy doesn't fly fast enough during the race, what if Jimmy messes up? His big chance. What if he's not allowed to become a knight? Ooh. Calm down, my dear. It'll be fine. Honestly, it's almost as though you become a completely different person when you're worried about Jimmy A. Hey. Listen, Jimmy. You better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time for the race. <gasps> Come on. You'll thank me later. Ooh, she wants to get fucked, yo. Wait, what are you doing? Here we go. Go on now, Jim. Go on now. Jump off the edge and call you Loftman. It's almost time for the ceremony. Let's try to practice the ceremony. Wait, what are you doing? Hmm. Oh, yeah. You can't sense your bird out there. Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. This is how Zelda's, like... You know why she's single, right? She did, she did this to all of her boyfriends. I am not aroused anymore, boys. Off you go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. What a fucking nutcase. Okay, Jimmy, go ahead, just press uh, down and call you off the wing. 
Ah, uh, where is he? Hmm. This bird should have taken a long time to get here. Something's wrong! Oh shit, she killed herself too! How are these people, like, so sure the birds are gonna come and get them? Eyelids floating in the sky. I cannot wait for Tears of the Kingdom, boys. Oh, there I am. Ooh. Are you two alright? I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't sprain your wing, did you? This is very odd. Jimmy, what could have possibly happened to you lawfully? For a bird to ignore the call of his master? It's unheard of. I bet you someone kidnapped him. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Jimmy? It's quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Well, I'm not a super saiyan, so... Jimmy, when you said you could have sent your loft wing, well... I should have believed you. I'm sorry. I need to tend to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. You better go ahead and see if you can find where your bird has gone. How did it get to be so late? How did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year, Instructor Hora, 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 <laughs> is president over the ceremony. Jimmy, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little so you can find your bird. I need to practice though, what the hell? <laughs> but Father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Jimmy asks Instructor Hora, Hora, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Not uh, quite true. As usual, you make an excellent point, my dear. Very well, I'll explain the situation to him myself. Jimmy, run along and tell Instructor Horal to come see him in my quarters. Zelda with your common sense. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, there you are. Well, how do we get out of here? Hmm. Don't worry, Jimmy. I'll be sure to explain your predicament to Instructor Horal. Go and find him and ask him. I'll be chat. Why don't you go see some other students about your bird? Um, I mean, I know what happened to the bird, so I'll just... Oh my god. I get it. I'm so used to moving uh, the camera with the right joystick. With uh, I mean, I just, like, freshly played. It's been like a couple weeks the last since I finished Twilight Princess. So I got, I'm gonna, like, screw up with that. I gotta hold the Z button. No, the L button. The Z button. What the fuck am I talking about? Oh, it's a ZL button. That's what it's called. Okay. I gotta hold the L button and then move around. Guess we'll save it. Alright, let's look for the instructor. Okay, um, before we go on, I want to give a very special shout out to Mr. Rio Rowan, who is currently streaming live on Twitch. I love giving shout outs to my friends. Um, also, shout out to uh, Heinz Catchup. I love giving you guys shout outs during my playthroughs. What the fuck happened to my game? This crashed. Um, baseball on the iPhone. Uh, Ryu streamed this game last summer, I believe. And I don't think you finished it. I could be wrong. Now, this just messaged me. Okay. Um. Yeah, Ryu started this game last summer, I believe. I don't know if he finished it or not. I could be wrong. If you're watching Ryu, let me know if you finished this game. Um, oh shit, the door's locked. Okay, well, that's the guy we gotta find, right? I don't know exactly what this- oh, we can't go in Zelda's room.
Um, this is a, it's a fun game. It's not my favorite Zelda game. This, I, I'm gonna guess, cures your hearts. You can start off with a lot of hearts, wow. It's not my favorite Zelda game, but it's pretty fun. Beat it once completely on the uh, Wii U. Not the Wii U, the Wii. And... I didn't beat it on the Switch yet. Love to be well, I'm definitely going to beat it now, so... It's not crazy about playing games on the Wii that, you know, involve a lot of motion with the fucking controls. Not crazy about the Wii remote. Where is this fucking guy? You're the guy I gotta look for. Oh, I think you're right here. What's wrong, Jimmy? Maybe not the guy I'm looking for. Your bro will come to you when you call it? For a law firm to lord ignore its master's call, something must be very wrong. For some to the whole but he's leaving today's ceremony. I should be made aware of what's going on. I see. Ten master's aware of the situation. And I'm sure he'll be delayed a ceremony for you. Okay, but where is this guy at? Uh, excuse me. His, his um, door is locked. Maybe he's not in here. Oh, and by the way, I took some melatonin so I may start feeling the effects of being drowsy. Oh, this is the wrong, it's the restroom. Uh, may feel the effects of being drowsy in a little bit. There's a hand that comes up there, right? Alright, well that was fun. Whoa! whoa. They have running water in this place? where I need to die that because I, I don't know where the fuck this guy is at. But I gotta wait till I get paid, so it's probably gonna be an episode or two of having no guy. Wait, are you are you Hodwell? Or Hoa? What's your name again? Oh there you are. Oh wow I gotta come in the whole time. What's wrong Jimmy? You're looking a little pale. What? Your law firm is missing? How strange and troubling. Do you think you can find him? You gonna start looking for him now? How will you make it back in time to fly in the ceremony? Looks like you participate in the ceremony hinges on the feather or not you can find that bird on time. Ah, <sighs> excuse me. I see, so the headmaster has summoned me? Alright, then I should go speak with him immediately. I still owe you for helping me out earlier, so don't worry about the ceremony for now. You focus on finding your waffle wing. Alright, let's find a little bird. I hope I don't accidentally save my original file, but it's not the end of the world if I do. I think the last time I was playing this game, I, I, I was focusing more on... I was focusing more on trying to get all this side shit. Hold on, J hold up, Jimmy. Hey, hey, Jimmy. Could you remember something? All you gotta do is dash and roll in that tree. It's like I've been doing. Dash? Okay, how do I dash and roll? Okay. Uh, while dashing, press L. Whoa, you did it! St Sky Stage Beetle, wait up! That kid is like a monster. Oh my god! All right, um, now I guess we gotta find out bird. I may know where he's at. I don't know how to get there. <laughs> oh man. So I'm guessing we can't get over that place. Yeah, I don't know exactly where to go. We do got a help button. Oh, it just helps with the moves and shit. So I don't know. Ooh. Do I need a neck to catch these bugs? Probably. I don't know what exactly um, are the differences between both games. I mean, obviously, with the Switch version of the game, you can um, play with an actual gaming controller, which is fucking game changing. It really is.
Um, but I don't know what I, I know. I can't remember. What's that thing's name that follows you in this game? Finn or Foon? Whatever the fucking thing. The blue thing. I don't know. I forgot its name. I think I remember her being a real pain in the ass in the Wii version, but I think they toned down her annoyances in this version. So um, it's a lot different. Okay, I need to get a sword. That's where I gotta go. I gotta get a sword. Uh oh, goodbye, boys. Why don't you step there? You can't depend on knights like me to swoop in and save. So basically, if you fall off, this asshole will come save you. And he's wearing Link's clothing. So does The Legend of Zelda really have a true timeline? And if so, what is the first game that's in the series? I mean, it always changes. I guess for a while it was Skyward Sword with how the story is. But after Breath of the Wild, and Tears of the, Tears of the Kingdom, I believe the next game's call is coming out very soon. It um, may not be Skyward Sword anymore. Is there any real story to this? Because I'm definitely curious. I, I watched the Angry Video Game Nerd <laughs> series. Uh, I guess trying to point, uh, pinpoint the uh, Zelda timeline together. It's, it's near impossible. Basically, all the Legend of Zelda games are is just you got awesome fucking video games. Go out there and just play them and enjoy them. <laughs> oh yeah, these assholes go. These guys are assholes. You know, Bruce. Stupid name. That sure was a pain. With all the scratching and pecking. Of course it was. You thought a big crimson loft ring like that was gonna go down without a fight? But we got him. I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He ain't not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. Okay, this guy's an animal abuser. Whoa, Jimmy. Uh, so, uh, yeah. How long have you been standing there? What's your problem anyways? Oh wait, I got it. You're here to talk about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. They're pleading- Oh, gross. Groose, whatever your fucking stupid name is. Can you please find it in your heart to let me win today? Please? You're just desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda up with that statue of goddess at the end of the ceremony. I- I just had alone time with Zelda, so shut up, dude. <laughs> well, sorry, pal. Groose doesn't do things- uh, doesn't do, do charity for wimps. My advice? Work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. Say, come to think of it, how come I didn't see a bird? Where's that scruffy pile of red feathers? I can't imagine what could have happened to him. Do you think his tiny brain got confused with all the clouds that got lost? Come back, asshole. Huh, I have no idea what you're talking about. You know, we're getting tired of how you never let anyone forget you and Zelda go way back. You've been friends since you were kids. Big deal. Does it change the fact that you float around? Or you float through life with your head in the clouds? Would you wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already? Dopes like you are dragging our honor academy through the mud. And just who might you be talking about, Groose? Oh, here's Zelda and she's pissed. Oh, Zelda, hey. Nah, it's, uh... Oh, she's pissed. Don't even try it, Groose. You're picking on Jimmy again, aren't you? He's a student at the academy, like all of us. Why don't you insist on bully why do you insist on bullying him around so much? Probably because my dick's bigger than his. Yeah, I suppose. You suppose suppose what? I suppose you uh he's in love. Forget it. I wasn't supposing anything, okay? Okay, we're out of here, boys. Later, Jimmy. Hope you find your bird, or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. That could be a major setback towards knighthood. So find that bird or get really used to the taste of failure. It's your special flavor. Yeah. 
I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect those blockheads have something to do with your loft wing's disappearance. No shit, Zelda. Jimmy, those guys aren't going to help us find your birds, so we better start searching. I'll fly around Skyloft, see if I can spot any traces of your bird. Father said he talked to Instructor Horrell about... <laughs> Sorry, I'm going to laugh every time I say that. Um, Horrell about delaying the start of the wing ceremony, so don't worry, we'll find your bird in time. So this is a game I would suggest any Switch owner have. It's a really good game. And the player's guide, I don't know if there is a Nintendo Switch version of the guide. I'm going to look online um, when I get paid again. If not, I'm going to have to get this, uh, the Wii version, which I guess is not all that bad. Uh, anything that I get towards this game will be added to the Legend of Zelda. Legend of Zelda. Anything that I get towards this game, player's guide or instruction manuals or anything like that, will be in the pickup video number 11. So check it out on YouTube. Sure, it's out by now, boys. Let's sound the goddess. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Okay, this is done. Oh, shit! God damn it. Oh, you're wearing red this time. That's cool. I'd be horrified to wear that fucking... by those birds. Okay, so honest to god, I don't know where to go next. I thought we had to go over there. Where's that guy with the sword, though? You can talk to people, do side missions and shit. I'm not gonna do them all. I will do some. That's really annoying. That was the one thing that bugged me in um, Twilight Princess on the Wii. I'm oh, sorry, the GameCube. Is that every time you... Okay, we can't even go to the shop right now. Every time you, you start a new day playing a game, um, you pick up the same rubies, it's gonna go through that annoying text. I, th I don't think they do it in this game. I think it's changed. So there's that. Hey. hey, Jimmy! What, Pip? Over here! That's some information about your lost way. Come over here. Let me tell you something. I am so looking forward to Tears of Kingdom. Or the Tears. Tear Jerker. Whatever the fuck the next game's gonna be called. I hope it's gonna be a really, really good game. I'm sure it is. Hey Jimmy, I'm uh, just looking for you. I heard your loft wing has gone missing, so I thought I'd join in the search. And get this, when I asked Flagg what he knew, and he started acting weird. I'm sorry, Jimmy. I wanted to tell you, but if Groose found out, I told you. Sounds like Groose forced him to keep quiet about it. Go on, tell him the truth. A little while ago, when I was cleaning the dining hall, Bruce and his buddies came in. They didn't notice I was there and started talking about their plan to hide your loft wings. I wanted to warn you, Jimmy, but I just got, tr uh, but just as I tried to sneak away, Bruce and his gang grabbed me. <laughs> they said that if I told you, they'd make sure I'd never be able to ride a bird again. And that Bruce and his buddy had a plan to capture your bird and hide him near a waterfall. Well, near a waterfall would mean, quick, let's take a look at your map. Oh, come on. That's it, right there. Mark with the X. Yep, the waterfall that I said. Forgive me, Jimmy. I can't help you be such a coward. I'm really sorry. Do you think you're making it in time? I'm such a, I, you should be sorry. Sorry for being so goddamn good looking. Oh! If you're going out to the waterfall, remember there are some dangerous things out there. Um, I need to carry a sword. Can I come in and go in their spurn hall a while ago? You go ask me if you can borrow one. Hey, it's Jimmy. So you still want to get some sword practice? Even though today is the wing ceremony? I'm impressed. The sword is in the back room. Go back there and get it. I've been here for a while, so if there's anything you don't understand about handling a sword, go ahead and ask.
Now, if this is a requirement to learn how to use a sword in the Wii version, I just I don't remember much of it. But I don't know if it is in the Switch. I think you, could, you can learn if you want. I'll turn the volume down a little bit. It's a little loud. Okay, so we got a sword. And there it is, right here. Practice sword. Now this game is not a normal smack mash in the B button type of type of uh, game. This is what gets confusing. Um, you can always use the Joy Cons. I believe you can use the Joy Cons. I use the gaming controller because this is how fucking video games should be played. And just slice away, just aim it. It's really hard. You'll, you'll get used to it though. Poking it, you just push a button. That's right, Jimmy. Okay, try a spin attack. Okay, let me learn how to do a spin attack real quick. Great, now I'm going to use the spin attack to cut all the spots. Okay, how do I do this? Okay, flick left, right, left. Good one. Alright, when enemy's down, target it. Up, down, up. That's the way. If it'll blow... Alright, so put it away. We're done here. Hey, Jimmy! You can't take the sword outside of Sparrow Hall. What do you think you're doing sticking out with that? What? Your loft ring's missing? You wanna go look for it? Well, I guess I could make an exception just this month, but remember that Skyloft is a peaceful place. Only knights carry swords. So I don't want you to see you swinging it around like crazy out there. I don't want to get in a ton of troubles over this, so here's the deal. Make sure you get plenty of practice on those logs first, and once you get outside with that sword, only as you absolutely have to. So I don't know if I mentioned this before. I think I did. Maybe I didn't. I don't remember. But the one thing I'm really trying to avoid with my channel is uploading a lot of clips, a lot of videos to one episode, one Let's Play, and... I mean, games that I really want to play, like Skyward Sword and Final Fantasy, it's obviously going to be more than a few uploads. At max, for games, I'm trying to only do, like, four... Wow, okay. Um, I'm trying to do four, but sometimes I gotta go over. Zelda games are massively long. This one's gonna be long. I apologize for I bore anyone with all these uploads. It's not my intent. I'm doing these games. I love playing these games, number one. And, and uh, I hope that you guys are enjoying them as well, so... Make sure you try to get these, uh... Stamina bars, fruits, uh, much as you can. If you want to have stamina, you're going to be uh, walking and you're going to go slow for a while. Just so stop running, you'll recover your stamina really quick. that noise yep you gotta be creative with that guys it takes a little bit of time to get used to the sword and on the uh, controller I will say there's a bat but you'll get you'll get the hang of it after a while If I get the guide for this game, I don't think I wanna. I, I think I wanna try and get a Nintendo Switch game if there is one. I cannot confirm if there is one or not. 
happy with the Wii version of this slide. I mean, I'm probably not going to use it anyways. I probably only use it for the bosses. I want to thank Mr. Bits and Glory. Um, he did spike up my interest in collecting guides, and I collected a bunch of guides over the year 2022. Um, so check those um, pickup videos out that I got. That I made. So, um... You see all the guys and instruction manuals and games that I've gotten over the last year and a half of doing this uh, YouTube show. And guys are so beautiful. They're so fucking beautiful. I had some guys growing up, you know, I had Ocarina of Time, I had Final Fantasy VII. Um, and, um... Dino Crisis and shit like that, and I'm not gonna lie, I didn't take very good care of my player's guides growing up. Ocarina is so messed up, Final Fantasy is missing pages, Dino Crisis is, is fucked up. And I feel so bad, I'm talking all these guides again in such great condition. And this is something that I should have taken care of growing up. And Majora's Mask, that's a, that's a little beat up, but that's not terrible. We got you guides, please take care of them. Jimmy, I was hoping I'd find you here. Heard you gone searching for your bird around the waterfall, so I thought I'd fly around and help you look. Um, how's your search going? Any sign of your loft wing? Well, stop talking about it. Keep looking. Oh, no. Well, let's not lose hope yet. There's still a place up ahead that grooves, grooves, <laughs> grooves, and his gang are always hanging around. Maybe we'll find something there. Huh? Whoa, who's that? Who's calling for me? Oh, sorry, Jimmy. I got distracted for a moment. Let's go. I think the melatonin is starting to kick in, boys. It is pretty late. I should just start... I should, this is my time where I start winding down from bed. Look, there he is. No doubt about it. That's your lost one, Jimmy. Alright, hold on. I'm hurrying. Looks like I'm gonna be done with sports for the night. My team won. That's good. Ryu Rowan is currently streaming Dead by Daylight and I have no interest in playing that game. I don't know how you young kids play that shit. <laughs> Skyward Sword's pushing it for me. Hey, but play games that you want to play, guys. Don't, don't, don't listen to the negativity or criticism. If you want to spend $60 on Madden and play on Rookie, then fucking do it. As long as you're enjoying the game, man. That's all, that's all you should do. We should hurry, Jimmy. Now that your law firm is free, you should fly to the ceremony. Oh, come on. I don't want to. 
But before you go, I have to ask you something. I I hear this voice a few moments ago. Did you hear it too? It's been happening a lot lately. It's the strangest feeling. It looks like someone's calling out to me. Have you ever wondered what's beneath the clouds? Some say that's an empty, barren place, or even that there's nothing at all below. I have this weird feeling that they're wrong. Some of my father's old texts talk about a place called the surface. The old tales describe a whole world under there, far more vast than Skyloft. The thing is, no one's ever been down there to see it, and our loft wings won't fly near the cloud barrier. But I can't help imagining the, the wild things that might be waiting below. Someday I want to see it for myself. Oh, sorry, Jim. We don't have time to talk. Let's get going. Look, your bird's waiting for you. Leap off the edge and press down. Don't worry about falling. The bird will catch you for sure this time. Are you sure? I mean, you killed like six of your ex boyfriends before. Okay, can we talk about um, the clothing that I am wearing? What's up with that? Oh, shit. Zelda's killing herself, too. Birds at the base just to make sure he's not hurt. You can fly your bird in any direction. When it's headed upwards, it'll slowly lose speed. When it's speed up, direct your bird uh, upward to gain altitude from dropping the fast dive. Again, okay, whatever. Offering the class, I think I'm going basic controls again. You can also charge, which also give you a burst of speed. I'll we'll slow down if you need to. Just move through the place. Huge relief. I don't know about you, Jimmy, but your loft wing looks like he's ready to fly again. Well, he's flying great again. I don't know what you said. My father and the others are probably worried about your birth, so let's go give them the good news. Again, have I mentioned that this game starts off incredibly slow? Your loft wing really is amazing, especially considering everything the poor guy has been through this morning. I want to fly back and tell father what happened. Oh, shit. Well, well, if it isn't Jimmy. Word around the plaza is that you found that dumb bird of yours. Well, that's just great, because you and your dumb bird can't tell time. All the pre-race pre pre warm-ups uh, me and the guys did were for nothing. Now I'm all stiff. We're waiting forever for the race to start. And the late, uh, late for you? I don't get it. The big flick is special treatment. Well, you are a fucking little twat sucker. You're almost a man, and yet you still can't seem to go anywhere without Zelda. But you can't even decide what type of lunch on your own, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's Zelda's pussy, and <laughs> you ain't getting any, dude. And don't think we ever noticed the smug looks. Oh, Zelda and I were best friends. We go everywhere together. Ugh. You think you're pretty su suave. Suave? Don't you? Well, don't you? Bruce has been going on forever about how he's going to be the one to be with Zelda. He's really got his uh, pompadour in the ruffle about her. <laughs> I hate to break it to you, but today's the day I bust up this adorable little fancy land you're living in. So I was playing the role of a goddess in today's ceremony, and I'm going to be the one to claim that sail cloth. When Hershey made it herself, man, there was no way I was going to let some scrawny clown snatch that prize from me. Oh yes, that's Zel that sail cloth, Zelda's sail cloth, will be mine. <laughs> oh man, I bet she's thinking about when she's, uh, okay, whatever. Can we skip this shit? Bruce, right behind you, right behind you. Well, I can't you see I'm in the middle of, uh... Oh, there she is. <coughs> can you explain us what you meant by our special moment alone? Yeah, nothing really, nothing big, really. Just, just, Jimmy, yeah, I was just telling my buddy 
Hear how glad I was he found the red bird of his. Boy, am I really looking forward to a fair race. Anyhow, later, Zelda. Look for me during the race. I'll be the one pulling off the dangerous moves. Groose looks like that kind of guy that, if he gets kicked in the nuts, he would really like it. Did you hear that guy? A fair race? Yeah, the chances of that happening are just about less than zero. Either way, don't let those fools get you down, Jimmy. Just get out there and fly the best you can. <laughs> I know you got those guys beat, and deep down, I think you do too. Us? Alone? Oh, I can't wait, baby. Yeah. That's a spirit, Jimmy. Trust me, you can win this. You were just doubting me like an hour ago, lady. The wing ceremony will now begin. Participants, students, please assemble. I think it's race time. Good luck, Jimmy. Oh, shit. I'm going to save it quick for the night. I could put it in sleep mode, too. Your attention, please. At last, we are ready to begin the wing ceremony. I was beginning to worry that we had to proceed without Jimmy, but luckily that is no longer a concern. I'm glad you could all make it. Before we start, I'll explain the rules for today's competition. I have attached a small st uh, statue da -da 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 to this bird. I know I, when I... Who I will then release to the skies, okay? My signal, dash from the starting line, dive off the ledge. Once you're in the air, mount your loft wing. I'm gonna call you bird permanently with this down button on. Okay, okay, whatever. Excellent. As you know, today's champion will graduate to the next class, bringing him one step closer to knighthood. Also, we. Uh, excuse me. I also receive a gift from the young woman who chose to play the role of the goddess in this year's ritual. Today's a special day for many reasons, but it's also the 25th anniversary of a fine institution. To celebrate the occasion, today's champion shall also receive his gift higher top of the statue of the goddess. The young woman performing this role as goddess this year has crafted the gift herself. Look at that guy's eyes. He looks like a serial killer. And as you well know, the role of the goddess this year will be performed by the lovely Zelda. I see your finest flying out there. Just show me how hard you've been practicing. Alright. Alright. Let's go. Um... I don't think there's any way you can lose this. I think they designed it for you to win. Oops, sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't know what I'm doing. Do I have to get close to it and hit a button? I, I don't remember what I'm doing. Hey, you little shit. I know Bruce like cheats, so... Come on, you little bitch. Oh shit, save the A button. Damn it! Popped up when I wasn't paying attention. Hey, who knows it's my to get all the glory? See, he's a little bitch. Hey, you heard him. Let's see how you fly with egg on your face. They're obviously cheating because Bruce Bruce cannot fucking live with the fact that I'm gonna get some Zelda pussy and he's not. Move you fucking pussies.
Got it. We got the bird statue. Proves your victory today. Wait till Zealous Zealous see it. What if I drop it and it falls beneath the clouds? I did it! I did it! I win! Jimmy! Oh shit, she's suicidal. You fucking kids play around with suicide too much in this fucking game. Let me tell you. Don't worry, I'm fine. You're fucking crazy for doing that, baby. Oh, come on. I don't want to hear any fucking bug shit. My work just keeps texting me. Great flying, Jimmy. Congratulations. Now we better get on with the ceremony. Jimmy, hand me that bird statue you grabbed in the race. You must offer it to the goddess. to a work message because my work phone's right next to me. I have Ryu Romer's plane to stream on it. Great goddess, God of light, and protector of our people. Grant us your blessing and mercy to act as your study, the, uh, st whatever, during the ceremony. Valor youth who grasp victory at the celebration of the bird folk in accordance to, with the old ways. I now bestow the blessing of the goddess upon you. Now I mentioned this in a long beginning to the game. We're not done yet, even after the ceremony. We're not done yet. <laughs> so I got a little bit more left to go. Your blessing of the goddess drift down from the heavens aloft a sail, which I now pass on to you. Oh, cool. I'll give it to a boat in the future. You get a sailcloth. You can now jump from any height without fear of painful landing. It smells nice, too. Yeah, because Zelda washed it. Jimmy, quit goofing. This is supposed to be a scared ritual, remember? You know, they say that the goddess gave the sailcloth to her chosen hero long ago. Of course, the one you're holding isn't the same one. I've been working hard to finish making the sailcloth in time to give it to today's champion. I'm really glad I got to give it to you, Jimmy. Make sure you take good care of it, okay? Thanks for making it up here to do this with me today, like you promised, Jimmy. <coughs> now we really should finish up this ritual. Ooh, shit, what are we doing? You do know what happens next. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> At the end, right? Uh oh. <laughs> no. Really? Huh? I thought you would have figured it out by now. Oh! Oh, baby. I'm a little nervous. Hey! Get to jump at the statue. Whoa, jeez. Well, give me a second. I'm a little stiff right now, lady. Look down. See that big uh, round design in the courtyard below? To finish the ceremony, you need to drop down in the center of it. Leap off the edge here. Right before you hit the ground, hit Zyar to open up your sailcloth. Just how brave are you? If you're really fearless, you wait till the last second to use the sailcloth. So ready to jump? Whoa! Zelda is a fucking crazy bitch. So how do I do this sailcloth? Oh, I failed. Oh boy, you messed up and landed. What's that noise? Yeah, that, that jerks you all of a sudden. So be a little careful with the controls with this. You get the hang of it then. That was perfect. You're amazing, Jimmy. The controls are like above average for me in this game. Maybe average to above average. You'll get the hang of it. It'll be smooth sailing after this sh um, shit. Cool, maybe our birds will fuck then. You know, Jimmy, seeing as you how you want today, 
And with the weather being so nice, you think maybe you like to, you know, go fly around the clouds together? I really want to save it. Fucking quit, man. It's late. Jimmy! Hey, Jimmy! Today was amazing watching you win the race and perform in the ritual together. I'll always remember this. It really was wonderful. Wonderful! You know, Jimmy... Something I've been meaning to talk to you about. What is that? What's going on? Jimmy! I have to say my goodbyes to, uh, uh, the boys in your stream. I'm not ready to fucking put it bad. Jimmy! I am waiting for you. The time has come for you to awaken. This thing is very fucking annoying, I'm not gonna lie. The time has come for you to awaken. You're, ver you're vital to our mission of great importance. Jimmy! Nope. Oh, I almost skipped it. Oh shit, we're still falling? Another bad dream. Ha, ah, so you're awake. When your loft wind carried you back, you were limp, you're limp and unconscious. I fear the worst. Fortunately, you don't appear to have any serious injuries. For that much, we can be grateful. If you're unconscious from being knocked out, does that tell me the count is sleeping? A little curious. But Jimmy, Miss Zelda, she was with you, was she not? What happened to my daughter? Well, I banged her. And she fell off uh, the clouds. The bird. Oh, you really, really going into detail. Holy shit. A black tornado, you say, huh? That was no ordinary storm. You must not push yourself. You're still recovering. Tell me, when you saw Zelda today, did anything about her seem off? Yeah, boys, Link is a mute. I see. She was talking about the surface then, and you've been having dreams about a great mission. How interesting. I'm sorry. I was just lost in thought there for a moment. It's all very strange, but I, I doubt there's much of a connection between these things. I'm concerned for Zelda, but so long as she's with her loft wing, I'm sure she'll be fine. Either way, Daybreak is like to arrive. It will be very difficult to spot one girl and her bird in the dark of the night. It will also be very dangerous. Rest now, Jimmy. Zelda's gonna be fine. She's out there alive. I know it. Fucking thing. <laughs> this fucking thing. This fucking guy. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is find a save point. Just call it quits for the night. Gotta follow this blue thing. 
All right, I'm coming, bitch. I'm hitting the ZL button. Just the camera right behind you. Again, L and look around. You can look around. Uh, first person view, hit up, and then you can look that way. So back out. You can, you just, you'll see it. Um, max rubies you carry at the beginning of the game is 300. If I did not mention that, I apologize if I repeat myself again. I'm gonna be repeating myself a lot in this game. Let's stay for right here. Uh, we're gonna resume this game. I'm enjoying it. Again, get past the first hour, hour and a half, and the game is really good, guys. Um, let's continue on. All right, so oh, there she is. Okay, okay. Come with you, bitch. No! Uh oh, remember this cute adorable little cat? Hey Mia! Yeah. Fuck away from me, you bitch! Oh wait, hold on, let go. There's a chest down here. Tea, boys. Boys. <laughs> oh, monster. <laughs> Man, get the fuck out of here, bitch. <laughs> yeah, just watch your stamina because you can lose that pretty quickly in this game if you're not careful. I don't remember if there's a way to improve it or not. I know in Breath of the Wild you can. <laughs> Alright, we're, we're here now. Here's Kitty Mamsy. this. I got a monster claw. Looks like a, looks like a, I don't know, dildo instead. Okay, special shout out to Fal, FTW, currently streaming Dragon Ball Z Kakarot on Twitch. Let me give him a shout out in the description below if you want to give him a follow. And everyone else to give shout outs to from now on. Was that the Master Sword? Oh, shit, what the fuck is that thing? Majin Buu? The one chosen by my creator, I've been waiting for you. You will play a role in a great destiny. It's pretty hot. According to your social, uh, social customs, I should provide you with a personal destination. Fee is the name I was given. I was created for a single purpose, long before the records of memory of your people. I must aid you in fulfilling the great destiny that is your burden to carry. 
Come, Jimmy. You must take the sword as the one chosen by my creator. It is your destiny. I don't want it to be. The strange dreams travel in your sleep, my sudden appearance, uncertainty surround the fate of the one you hold dear. Under the circumstance, it is only logic that you would exhibit some apprehension. Okay. To minimize your uncertainty, allow me to share some information. My projections indicate that this information has a high probability of altering your current emotional state. Yeah, she's like Scott Steiner with all the fucking like probabilities and predictions and whatever. The one you seek, Honorable Zelda, is still alive. But Scott Steiner's a lot better than this fucking bitch right here. And this spirit maiden, the one you call Zelda, is another chosen one fated to be a part of the same great mission. Therefore, should you wish to meet with your friend, I highly recommend you take up the sword before you go out, before you set up the search for her. Does that information, uh, and think, and immigrate you? Are you ready to accept the sword? Can't say no to that Zelda pussy, though. Hey, hold on, I gotta blow my nose real quick. Sorry, boys! Sorry, boys! And stuffy and running is weak. A little sick. Change of season. It seems that further uh, persuasive measures will not be required. I don't know. Zelda pussy. What do you want me to do? In the name of my creator, draw the sword and raise it skyward. Oh, skyward. That's the name of the game. Alright. How did no one know this or sword's here? I mean, come on. Seriously? Ready stance. Oh, now I gotta get cute with the controller. Raise it high. Raise it high. Ho, 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 ho. Okay. I don't think the Master Sword is in this game. You have the Goddess Sword. The Mysterious Sword is bathed in divine light. Recognition complete, master. Jimmy, my master. <laughs> A master in the bedroom? What the hell is this? Oh, my water bottle. Hey, kitty. <laughs> Jimmy. Oh, shit. So you knew about this sword the whole time. I had my suspicions, but I wasn't, until now, I wasn't sure. <laughs> Yet, here we are in the chamber of the sword. The very place where it was foretold the youth of the legend would one day appear. How do you not know this is here? It is said that this place was left to, to our people by the goddess herself. The very knowledge of this room, the existence, and the secret passed down to a select few, each generation, along with a handful of wards. When the light of the goddess of swords shines bright, the great apocalypse will wake from its long slumber. Do not fear, for it's then a, that a youth, guided by a hand, shall reveal himself in the place most scared. It started days ago. The story that I've kept secret all these years. <sighs> you dick. She knew about the thing the whole time, didn't you? It began to give off a faint, otherworldly light. At first, I was sure I was seeing things. Here alone, with the sword, and there was simply no other explanation. I never dreamt the prophecy of legend would come to the past in my lifetime. The words I have sworn to keep secret are coming true before my very eyes. <clears throat> the youth will be guided by one born of a blade. What is also useful and likely to get wise by blah 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 Come on, enough of the talking already. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, the old tradition, one of the least uh, reliable methods of information. Okay, I think I'm done reading. I think I'm done reading. But now, after this part, the game actually gets good. And get the sword. It's been what? It's been like an hour. So we are. It's a slow start. But I don't know what's slower, this game or Twilight Princess. Twilight Princess was really slow. It might be Twilight Princess because you didn't get the sword until uh, much later. I think, right? Maybe. 
Damn, that was so hot. Yeah, I'm done reading. I don't want to read right now. My nose is all fucking clogging up and shit. Okay, embark on the great journey beneath the clouds to the vast realm of the surface. I said I was done reading and I lied to you boys. I'm so sorry. This is no easy task, Jimmy. The world below is a forsaken place. When you reach it, you must pierce the cloud barrier below. It's just fucking clouds, okay? It's just fucking clouds. In the living memory, no one's ever done this. A lot of dry skin behind my ears. Well, that was like a dungeon what we just did. This tablet will illuminate a path through the clouds to the land below. Take it and place it within the altar behind me. Okay, so Skyward Blast, you gotta hit the crest. Oh, you done talking? Finally. Um, I think I gotta do it from here. So we do this, I go, hi -ya! Oh, I was too, uh... Am I too far away? I gotta go right here, I guess. Oh, 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 oh! Sorry, boys, sorry, 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 sorry. That was my alarm, I did not turn my alarm off. Why did I not turn my alarm off? The Iron Sheik song wakes me up in the morning. <laughs> Alright, now I miss what I gotta do. Damn, this guy's uh... This guy's going hand with uh, giving out bits to foul. I don't know what to say. Right, what am I doing now? Master Jimmy, please insert the stone tablet you recently acquired. Oh, right here, I guess. Sorry, I got distracted by my phone. My alarm in the morning. So there's three dungeons we gotta do to finish up the stone tablet. Then we'll jump in a bird and fly to this part. Master Jimmy, it is done. Until now, a cloud barrier created by the goddesses has separated the world you know from the one below. The tablet you place in the altar uh, has opened a small rift in the barrier. You can use it to travel through the clouds to the realm below. I have recognized you as my master, and so it's my duty to follow you wherever you may go. Okay, if you want to talk to her, Press the down button. And trust me, guys, like, she was super fucking annoying in the Wii version. Jimmy, listen a moment. Well, I've been doing listening most of the game so far, so you might as well keep going. The nature of the Great Apocalypse, mentioned by no text, is complete mystery. This is why this game's so fucking long. There's so much fucking talking. This is like worse than Metal Gear Solid 4. Maybe not that bad, but still. Okay, um, okay. I didn't read you what you said, but okay. Do you people proud, Jimmy? I'm, uh, I wanna go back to your daughter. Dawn is near, draw near. It has been a long night for the both of us, hasn't it? It's been a great journey for you. And these clothes, you don't look up to the task. Yeah, they look like a hobo. The uniform you would receive for one in the race should be ready by now. A sturdy uniform. Like that will prove much suitable for a long journey. You better change before you go. <laughs> yes. Okay, so I mentioned earlier about the timeline. Obviously, I think Breath of the Wild takes place before everything else. I could be wrong. I don't know. You figure this game definitely is number one. Breath of the Wild, though. Well, he didn't have the green tunic, that's that's for sure. 
The green uniform is what our knights will be wearing this year. To be honest, I have my doubts about the color. Badly enough, seeing you wear this uniform, I can't imagine a more fit and color for you. It's as though you were born to wear it. In the new Zelda game coming out, the islands are in the sky. So you figure maybe those two games take place before this one. If this Zelda timeline is real. Alright, I'm done. Stop talking to me. Go find your daughter and go bang her. Alright, five bucks. Um, this game is like very different with shields and stuff. Um, you're gonna buy a lot of shields. Oh, son of a bitch! Jimmy! What's wrong with the cheeks, bro? That green uniform looks so adventurous. You sure no look like a knight now. The headmaster said you're headed out to look for Zelda. You're really something else. I could never imagine myself doing what you're about to do. Put a lot of work into making this. You should take it with you. Look at the adventure pouch. Oh, thanks, bro. You got the adventure pouch. You can store all kind of useful items and handy pieces of gear. So your shields, other shit. Adventure pouch is for adventurers. It's neat because you can fit four things that you'll need on your big journey. All right, potions and shield to fit right in it. Jimmy, I know you're going to find Zelda for us. Oh, okay, I'll let you bang Zelda, too. I'll let you, I'll let you watch. You can watch. Um, yeah, that's a little weird. Um, yeah, shield, you're going to go through a lot. It's like Breath of the Wild with these swords and shit. Um, I, the, the, um, I don't know if there's a permanent shield in this game. I can't remember. I'm sure there is. And... You do side quests and shit, you can add more pouches and whatnot, so. Yeah, a lot of talking. Have I mentioned a lot of talking? Massive update regarding the stone tablet and the resultant column of the light it created. The column of light. Shut the fuck up, bitch! Got a hoping tearjerker. There's no, uh, they're not talking as much. I know it's that called tearjerker. It's like a James Bond movie. What the fuck? Oh, young man, what clamorous visions appear before me? No, leave me the fuck alone, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, here's a shield right here. That's a wooden shield. There we go, that's how you equip shit. Um, can I buy this? Okay, I gotta get a bomb bag. Cause I can't buy this either. What about this shit? Oh, come on, bro. Should I buy two shields? This lady right here can repair shit and fix it. Look how sad he looks. Alright, I'll buy one more. Alright, leave me alone, but dude. Well, I don't have a bottle. You're a doable boy with the golden hair. Look at the potion shot. Drink my potions when you're injured, fill up the hearts. Uh, let me tell you, look, leave my one of my potions, so don't try to st without stocking up. Oh dear. You have to have if you have an empty bottle on you. Can't say your potion have an empty bottle. For some reason I like you though, so I'll give you a spare empty bottle up and keep oh, thanks, lady. I hope I have enough money for your potions. Oh fuck yeah. So the potion's right there, okay.
Okay, how do I... Okay, so that's where I gotta go. Ooh, you're hot. These fucking people. Careless and reckless jumping off the place like that. I mean, you're free to go out and do other shit too, um, but I'm going to uh, do this um, dungeon first. So you just jump down in the clouds below, but what the hell's gonna catch you? Gravity will catch you. Oh, the sail cloth. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Here's more talking. Master Jimmy, we've arrived. You have no shit. This is the uh, fable surface that has been long part of Skyloft legend. From my calculations, you are currently positioned in the location known as the Sealed Grounds. And as we progress through the game, more and more of the map will unlock. The map's much bigger than it looks. Please proceed with caution, Master. Now you gotta be like... You gotta kill these things exactly how their mouths open up. What's going on? <laughs> you fight that thing a few times in this game. He's not that big. Not that bad. He ain't that scary. Oh, he's pretty scary. He took it back. What's that disease? What's that? I shouldn't say disease. What's that called? PTSD? From his dreams, I guess. I mean, he never experienced that thing in real life yet. Now of your shield is beneath the heart, so um, to use the shield. How do I use the shield again? Okay, the left joystick. Man, the controls are a little strange in this game. You probably shouldn't play this game um, right after you play like Skyward uh, uh, Twilight Princess. So. Alright, so we probably have to go down below.
That thing's horrifying. Young one, try to let destiny descend from the sky. Raise the sword of the goddess. Uh, raise the sword of the goddess Skyward. Take aim at the evil aurora and lift its power. Master Jimmy, I'm sensing a change in the area that was triggered by the Sky Ward strike. I have also detected an aurora that uh, correlates closely to your sailcloth. I assume, uh, so you've been sniffing my sailcloth? You goddamn creepy bitch. I can lead you the direction of the aurora through a process known as Dowsing. Would you like me to explain this process to you? Nah, because I already know how to do it. Understood, Master. So all it is is that you go into first person mood, vote, um, mode and uh, the sword will uh, I mean it'll like, it'll beat if it's like Zelda's in that direction, so. I gotta select it first. See how it's beeping like that? Going that direction. We get a lot of those thousand abilities, uh, different kind of abilities throughout the game, so. Is there anything important I should grab over there? Maybe not. I don't know. Do, 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 do. How's over here? Um, so technically, I know I started this, the, the first file on this, I never completed it, but I've only beaten this game just once, that was it. So I'm not a big Skyward Sword guy, mostly because it's such a long fucking game. It doesn't really interest me that much. Okay, let's keep doing this, boys. Alright, so I think I'm ready to, uh... I bullshit... No, I guess I didn't bullshit, really. But I saved inside here, and then I... Had on pause, wait for my dryer to finish. Oh! Shit! Fuck! Oh! Fuck! Oh, shit! I killed it! Damn, I wasn't... <laughs> I didn't think we could kill the bugs. My bad. Alright, where's this old lady at? Wait, wait, wait. Can you break some more pots? No, oh, treasure chest. Nice. Open, testing it. So I get an extra bottle? Alright, I got an extra bottle. That's pretty cool. Ah, oh, great, a fairy. God damn it. Sorry, Mr. Fairy. You turn it down, it's a little loud, and it's actually really loud. Holy fuck. Alright, guys, in the comments below, I want you to tell me your favorite Zelda game. 
what Zelda game and what Zelda game you haven't beaten yet. If you know me, my favorite Zelda is um, Link to the Past. And I haven't beaten two Zelda games yet, at least in the main series. And that's Zelda 2, which I do want to do for the- I'm going to do for the channel if I haven't done it yet. And I say if I haven't done it yet, I don't know when I'm posting this video. <laughs> so, um, and I haven't beaten Spirit Tracks. I'm almost done with Spirit Tracks, but I, I'm so sick of playing Spirit Tracks. I'm so sick of those two Zelda games on the DS. Listen for the Switch with modern controls, I bet you they'd be really good. I like the game, just hate the controls in that game. Lady, you got a fucking oatmeal cookie stuck to your head. Oh, it's your hair. Ah, the traveler descended from the clouds above. I welcome you, child of fate. The old one? <laughs> Tell me, what is your name? Jimmy. The Jimmy? Ah, good, very good. I said you have gained control of the scared power, the scared power that filled your sword when pointed skyward. The skyward strike is yours to command. It is proof that you are fit to bear the blade you carry, the goddess sword. I have sat here for many years, waiting for you to arrive. Where are you? Sucks to be you. <laughs> also, that I could fulfill my purpose as your guide. Yeah, I like to keep women waiting, boys. Uh, you stand under the roof of the sealed temple, a place built by the gods an eternity ago. Well, the thing's falling apart, so... Rago here was a pristine many, many years ago. The spirit maiden you seek to arrive... You speak... Uh, you seek to arrive here shortly before you descend into this land in the shower of light. There's no doubt in it. The gears of fate has begun to turn. Yet, all is not as it should be. The spirit maiden was not meant to reach this land in the manner she did. I feel an evil power working in the shadows, and it moves to warp the destiny of which you two are a part. Jimmy, you are concerned for the spirit maiden and seek for her whereabouts. Yes, her name is Zelda. Get her right or pay the price, old lady. That's understandable, but for now you must focus on moving forward. The girl's her own purpose. She must pursue, as do you. She set off her fair and woods to discover that destiny for herself, and you must follow. Show me your map. I said your map. I showed him my penis. I couldn't help myself, boys. You will travel in unfamiliar land. Many, if you're a little kid and you're in my fucking video, get the fuck out of here, by the way. Many monsters have settled here and the map has not proved guidance enough for your journey. And so I will give you the power to create beacons. Okay. Are you fucking done talking? I don't fucking care, you goddamn huwa. At least big at that location. Okay, where am I at? Right here? Okay, stop talking. Seriously. Your fucking hair looks gross. You probably got lice in it. You are ready. Leave through the door before you and head into the woods. I wish you safe travel. Know that all questions. Know that all questions you have now will be answered in time. For now, go, Jimmy. Go, 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 go. Yes, ma'am. Oh, let me say it for the game crashes. Switch games crash a little too much. It's great when you lose power; you don't lose anything for the Switch. But um, yeah, when the game crashes, it sucks. I don't think this game crashed on me yet. Yet. How do I roll again? I got. I got. I got to get a player's guide for this game. I wish they would have made keep the motion controls, but I wish they would have made controls more simple instead of like they did here. I want to swing the sword with the B button. <clears throat> But then again, this game was pretty much designed with the Wii motion control. So... I don't know how you also would you know, make a game for regular controls. Are those monkeys? I wish 
take a take a sword and just chop bushes and get free money. Oh, wait a second. Is that where I came from? There's a beacon we just placed in the map. Oh shit! Oh, they're, they're beating up that Goron. How do I how do I roll again? Who's okay? L button. Wait, what the hell? Is that how you roll? Uh, press L while dashing. Okay, hold on. Well, those are the controls right there. How do I, how do I run again? <laughs> There we go. Okay, I got it now. Coming, bro. Leave me alone! Who wants to die? Out of the way, scram. Look at that guy's not fucking coming. We got your back, bro. Hey, fucker. Oh, took that one skull. Looks like it came straight from my, um... One of those Halloween cereal boxes. Blueberry or Count Chocula? Frankenberry. Oh, that one's gross. Ooh, thanks for jumping in there and rescuing me, bud. This Goron looks like a big giant piece of shit. That's stuck in your asshole for a while. Just who are these red pests? I did not expect to run into a pack of them in a peaceful forest. Dude, this forest is nothing but peaceful. Anything but peaceful. Same goes for you. This is the second time I've been bumped into your client today. I'll tell you what. All sorts of weird things are going on lately. I owe you big for taking care of those red for taking care of those guys, so let me tell you something fascinating. Hey, hey bud, I am Google <laughs> the Goron. I am researching the ancient history of these woods here. Gorko. I'm not gonna remember your name. According to the ancient text, there is some kind of uh, place up ahead called the Isles of the Goddess. Far up far up in the sky. Apparently this old statue serves as landmarks so that was traveling up to the sky or down from the Isle of this uh, goddess place. If you ever find one, be sure to examine it. Keep tabs on a number of landmarks. They are rumored to be quite useful. Supposedly the statue is special as it's said to have the ability to activate all the other statues. Mm. The whole thing sounds a little crazy. I know. But I, for one, believe it to be true. It's true. It's damn true. Otherwise, why would all these statues be uh, all over the place? I don't know, you think maybe someone's trying to fuck with you or something? It's a real head scratcher, bud. Makes me want to know more, does it? No, no. Uh, so, bud, I was hoping to tell you more. I guess I can wait. Yeah, I don't want to hear it, dude. Get the fuck out of here. Crusty piece of shit. Oh, what the hell? Whoa. What in the world just happened? Did you use some kind of magic? It's actually reacting the moment you got near it, but how crazy is that? Yeah, get the hell away from me. Seriously, get the fuck away from me. So you can go to the sky, save, save and quit. There is, um, what the fuck are those things called? There's little toys from the Nintendo. I mean, I have a couple of them. That you use, and Mobies or something like that? I only have a few of them. Goro, what was that? I just fucking saved the game. Get the fuck away from me, dude. I have a few of them. And, um... None for this game, but there's there's one that, um... That you can have, you get for this game. And it, uh, I guess, like, it, you can teleport anywhere you want. Or go to the sky anywhere you want. I don't collect these things. I do have a few for... Breath of the Wild, I have Wolf Link. I have um, Link with the Ocarina. Which, what did that do in Breath of the Wild? I think it, I think it used that, it, it rains meat or something like that. And I have one for Link's Awakening, uh, which you can just save to the, uh, save your dungeon from Link's Awakening to it. And just, Bring it to your friend's house, but I don't know anyone who has that fucking game, personally. What are these fucking toys? Except for Bits and Glory. Wait, I was here already, goddammit! Why are you telling me to go this way, fucker? God damn- All this talking! Let me play the game! Master, now that you have access to stone statue, you can return to the sky at will. Furthermore, furthermore, by carrying a certain- yeah, that's what I was talking about. A Milby figure. You can return to the sky from anywhere in the surface and come back to where you left. Please call me anytime you would like to use 
So you call this bitch for that. But seriously, stop talking to me. Let me play the fucking game. That's exactly what I was talking about. But I don't think any of mine will work in this game. More talking. Master, I've entered Farron Woods. I can't tell I did that, huh? Thank you for telling me this. Thank you for wasting my fucking- Seriously, I'm just- I'm super annoyed right now with this game. I hate games that talk so much. Let me play the game! The plentiful water in this region clearly sustains a large diversity of flora, including the massive tree. It is logic that the lush plant life and water researchers have attracted animal species to the region. Okay, I don't care. No, stop, stop talking, stop talking. I can't even skip this. Can I? Oh, I said, yes, I can. I'm skipping it. I don't give a shit. You know, I always thought that was a seven on the statue. It was just a bird. I just noticed it right now. It's a fucking bird. Great, more talking, huh? What's up, bro? Huh? It's gone quiet. Yeah, it's a lot of those fucking things are torturing you. Kiku, now there's a green one. I don't even know why they come in, why they came in green. Don't hurt me. Co weep. See ya, bro. Thank God it ran away. I was gonna kill it. Oh wow, more talking, go figure. I'm a bad man, you better run, dude. Oh cool, I have to kill a fucking monster all this now. Thank god. The game just got good all of a sudden. What's that noise? Oh, this thing. Wait a second. What the hell? What the hell? Get over here, fucker! Okay. Yeah, that'll make him scared even more. Stabbing the fucking mushroom away. Huh, let me guess. Did you hide behind that mushroom? Stop running, you little shit. <sighs> Excuse me. I, I, I think I enjoyed Twilight Princess. I didn't mind it. If it ever comes out for the Switch, I'll probably get it for that. I'll probably play through it again. I don't care. Wind Waker, I didn't mind as much. I liked it, but I really hate it looking for the Triforce shards. Yeah. 
Fave is definitely linked to the past, though. Oh my god, I, I can play the game over and over again. What up, shithead? I spotted me again! Whee! Huh? You don't want to eat? You don't want to eat me? Quee! Come to think of it, why'd you fight off all those red monsters? Are you Bulbasaur? Kali, I'm Machi. I'm a I'm a Kikwi. Kikwi? Kickhead. Kickhead. You seem okay, even though you're scary. You're scary. Thanks for helping me. Kitty says that to me all the time. I don't know why. I'll keep you warm, baby. That that's weird. Kiku. A little while ago, I ran into another funny animal like you, but it was a girl. Who? I don't play with girls. I don't know who she was, but she seemed to be in big trouble from where I saw her. Is she a friend of yours? A pack of those mean red guys were after her. Whee! But she escaped with a kiki, a kiwi, a oh, elder. Elder? Elder? Oh! Why are you fucking tell- The thing just fucking told me! Oh, you're talking about the kiwi? Well, you just get the fuck back in the sword, you're freaking it out. You really spooked me. Whee! You have some strange company, friend. Whee! -la 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 -la. It sounds like you're set, uh, set on finding this friend in Elder. If you're heading that way, anyways. Whee! Would you mind telling our Elder that I'm safe? Cheer up. Whee! I bet your friend is safe. Guys, I may skip a lot of texts. I, I don't give a shit at this fucking point. It's such bullshit. All this unnecessary talking and shit. I, I don't want to listen to it. Okay, where is the map at? Hold on a second. Okay, where is Zelda? Where is your where is your where's your tits at, Zelda? Oh, oh! Go this way, boys! I don't think we can go this way, because there's this fucking thing right here. Well, yes we can. Hey! Say hello to Satan. Okay. Say hello to Satan. I can't remember the first time I played this game, it was after high school. Whenever it came out, I guess. The first time on the Wii. And I remember putting a lot of hours into it. Oh! Shit. Well, there goes my no damage run, boys. I would like to do a no death one for Link's Awakening. <laughs> but, uh, well, actually, I did that once before, but not on camera. I guess no no death runs and shit. You have to go do it online, streams and stuff. And I, I can't really stream right now. Uh, my internet's not it's not gonna hold it. Yeah, Link's Awakening for the Switch. I did do a Deathless one before. On Heroes Mode? But you had to do a lot of, uh, <laughs> a lot of bullshit. You gotta keep going, you gotta keep going back and see Crazy Tracy, get the potion and stuff. And, uh, the hardest part, if you're gonna do a Deathless run in Zelda games, the hardest part to me is like the first two dungeons, or first two or three dungeons. And once you get past that, it gets relatively easy because you have more heart containers. You'll have um, you have better items, so it really works out for you in the end. But I had to uh, 
really, really, really. Uh, I had to keep going back and being careful. I keep going back to see Crazy Tracy. I don't know what happens when you beat Link's Awakening without dying. I don't know if you have to do this on, on Heroes Mode or Master Mode, whatever the hell it's called. But you just see Marin up in the sky at the end of the game. That's it. Oh, of course I miss. But I love Link's Awakening. That the Switch version might be my favorite version of the whole series. Oh, here's a big son of a bitch right here. Wake up! Quee! I am <laughs> the elder, the ki the kiwi, the kiki, the kiwi. I saw the way you spotted me through my uh, ingenious uh, camouflage. Whee! You are clever. Clearly a master woodsman. Where's Zelda? Zelda? Ah, the girl creature with the blonde hair. She was beautiful. I liked her tits. But now's the time for such talk. The woods are full of monsters. I am worried about my missing tribe. Oh, come on. Quee, the shock and worry has made memories of the girl quite hazy. What? You said you met some of my people? So, my chi is safe. Ah, but the monsters are still lurking in the forest. I don't dare leave the spot. Three ki kiwis are still uncounted for. Can I ask you to search for them and make my make sure they are safe? Quee! I am worried sick for my fellow ki kikwis. 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 If you can claim my fears, call my fears, I might be able to remember more. So that basically this fucking piece of shit was bribe uh, blackmailing me pretty much. Well, not really blackmail, I guess. Yeah, I'm gonna, every time she talks, I'm, I'm just going to skip it. Which, all she's going to do is tell me you have like a... She's going to talk to me like Scott Steiner would talk to me. You have like a fucking 65.23 and a half chance of finding Zelda in this direction. Shut the fuck up and let me find her, okay? Let me find your fucking kids. Oh. Oh, that's Zelda. Oh! We're going, boys! Wait a second! This is the one I. No! No! There's one up there. It's not this one. Well, I gotta go up there. What am I doing? We need bombs to blow them up. We get bombs a little later. Oh. You lose stamina, spinning your sword and shit. Well, there's one over there for sure. We're gonna go over there in a minute, but I think there's one down the hole right here, right? No, I guess not. I have a feeling we should go down there. I will go down there. Hold on, I'm gonna go this way first, though. You know, fuck it, fuck it. I don't care. I don't care, I'm going this way first. My mind's made up. What the hell? Bulbasaur? Don't hit me, I taste terrible, let me go. Uh, the other was worried about me. I'm glad to hear he's safe. I'm Olo. I don't care what your fucking name is. Leave me alone. 
Oh, right in the head. Right in the noggin. Right in the kisser. Pow! Now, I did see a heart piece over here. That I want. this going to be? I'm the Undertaker. Alright, that thing we have to hit. But I don't think we can hit that one just yet. Those are like those goddesses cubes where you do a skyward strike and then it sets off in the sky and shit and then... Um, you go through like a bit of like a treasure chest somewhere in the in the world will open up. And I don't know if I can get that one right now. There is one a little further into the forest. You fucking dick. Alright, enough of this. That was a dungeon that I think? I'm gonna go this way. Come on, you little shits. Fuck these guys. That, at least one ruby. Thank you. Right, so how do I get up here again? I'm not doing that way. Just go up here. No, I want to leak. God damn it! Why would it let me leak? Okay. Hey, why was that so hard to do? Oh wait, okay, all that and I have to I need a bomb. Oh wait, no, I gotta come up here anyway. I'm not doing this for the money, I'm not doing this for the key keys. I'm doing this for the rock. I did it for the rock. Hey! Stop fucking moving, dick! I've been discovered, and here I thought I had a good hiding place. Alright, go, go find your fucking lord, your fucking dad, or whatever his name is. I wish this last little shit at. Probably in the tree. But what's over here, though? If I had to rank my Zelda games, um, Link to the Past is number one. Number two might be Ocarina of Time. Three has to be Link's Awakening. And after three, it doesn't really matter to me, I guess. I mean, 
Maybe four is Breath of the Wild. Five might be Twilight Princess. I have to make this list, guys. I gotta make this list. And my least favorite has to be Zelda 2. And I'm not saying that's a bad game, although I never finished it. Okay, I can't get underneath the water yet. I just, um... If it wasn't so brutal with grinding, I hate playing that game, grinding, and then I just die all of a sudden. And then I gotta start all over again. Like, God damn it. And you know what, I really don't want to beat that game with save states. It doesn't feel natural when you do stuff like that. It's a tough game. It's a really tough game. I'll give it, I'll give it to, to, to anyone who was able to beat it back in the 80s. Okay, we're close to this little shit. Is he up here? I think it's on the other side of this, uh, cliff. Oh, that sucks. I can't go over that way. Well, my aunt's home, that means I can't rage anymore. But I gotta find this monkey, where the hell's this fucking monkey at? There's a log up there. Wait, he's right there, what the fuck? How do I get over there? How do I put up the map again? Is it select? Okay, so the little shit is like right in this direction. Hold on, I got a CBS notification. Not the notification I want to see. Alright, so there has to be like a cave somewhere that we go to. You know what, boys? I think I know the place. Maybe I don't. I don't know. Kitty is fucking snoring her ass off. Alright, I'm gonna go the long way around, I guess. I don't know what else to do. Alright, I didn't go in here yet. Another fairy. How do I get these bombs off of here? Okay, it's one bomb. Fuck it, I'm just gonna deal with it. I'm still doing this for the rock. Uh oh. Come on, Jimmy! God damn it, we we're so close. <sighs> well, I'm with this piece of heart's falling. 
gonna go all the way back? Really? Seriously? Very still flying. Oh look, look at my shield. My shield took some damage. You notice that? That's why I grabbed two shields. Leave that fucking thing alone. Oh shit! He fought the bros! Oh, I want the heart! I don't care about you! all the monsters. Okay, throw down the rope. You owe me a dollar, you little shit. Um. <laughs> so we found all the kids. Ouch, that was effective. Anyways, thanks to you, I'm safe. Really, the other was worried about me? Well, I'm glad to hear he's safe. My name's Papasa. If you said the other, can you please tell him where I am? Oh, quick, 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 quick. Oh, God. You're just, all you're doing is frightening the fucking poor little squirrel Bulbasaur motherfuckers. I'm sorry, my friend's a little rude. More rude than I am for skipping your text. All right, we gotta swing, boys. Wait, I wanna swing. Oh, the R button. One more swing would be good enough. Here we go, boys! Just made it. All right, so I think we gotta find the Elder again and tell him that everyone's safe. jump up there. That's right, because uh, Link is not Kobe Bryant. I should say Muggsy Bogues. Am I saying his name right? The basketball player is like 442 and he leaving a dunk over anybody. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I found your stupid kids. Whee! So my fellow Kikwees. Oh well, so they want me to stop worrying? Oh, excellent, they know me too well. You have a real talent for finding whatever is missing. I don't know who you are or where you come from, but you have my thanks. I feel much less worried. I believe I just remember where that young lady went. Young lady, that girl, Zelda, was that her name? Yes, it was all coming back to me. So they had to travel to the temple, deep within these woods. Oh, I tried to warn her about how dangerous it was there, but clever little thing bolted off uh, my belly, blah blah blah, okay. I get it. You tried to you try to bang my Zelda, I get it. Make sure that way to the temple. Be sure to take care of her if you follow her. The air is crawling with monsters. <laughs> ah yeah. Sorry, watching some baseball right now, boys. Oh, he's dead now, thank god. Oh shit, thanks, bro. How do I get that? Get the slingshot!
Alright, so we got our first main item. I'm gonna change our main item, just hit the ZR button. Go to your pouch. Is that the same as your pouch? Your pouch is different. How do I use this again? Okay. Oh, that was that was nice. With that slingshot, you should be able to find the path in the deep woods where the temple is. To start, why not try shooting that crow that vine over there? Hold Z to ready your slingshot. Okay. Thanks, dude. You're probably more useful than the, uh, you little fucking stupid kids. Stuka seeds used for the slingshots, I believe. Here is a save point. I'm gonna save it and take a shower. Oh, come on! Master, I highly suggest you save the progress of your quest for your setup for the temple deep within the woods of Pursuit of Zelda. Oh, wow! Wow! Like, I wasn't gonna fucking do that. Alright, let's carry on, guys. <laughs> okay, um. Took my melatonin, so I'm gonna feel drowsy probably within the next 30 or so minutes. Or I may start feeling drowsy. Oh, nice shot. That's not updated. So I'm not used to the controls just yet. I'm still getting used to them. I don't fuck with that guy, boys. And once we go through our first runs to the first three dungeons, we'll come back to these parts of these maps and even more of the map will be unlocked, so... The map is a lot bigger than what it looks like. <laughs> Oh, shut the fuck up. Oh shit, now I'm exhausted, now they're gonna fuck me up. There's a way to uh, get around those bees. I wanna get the honeycomb, but uh, I don't always get what you want, boys. But you get what you need. I don't need anything. Alright. Now this is going to be a little bit of an issue. Get back!
I don't know, I thought I could kill those things, but I guess I couldn't. Oh my god, this is fucking scary. Let me cross first, dude. Let me fucking cross! Oh, he's dead. Oh, come on, dude. I didn't want to fall off. Oh, come on, dude. Seriously? That was pretty cool. <laughs> I, did, I did not know we could do that in this game. <laughs> oh, okay, that was, that was awesome. I don't know if we can do that. It's probably the first time I ever did that. Oh. Oh, you can sit, and I believe sitting down actually um, gives you some hearts. But and we obviously don't need any hearts because we're maxed out. I don't need to save it. I keep saving it. Although I'm somebody who I'm telling you to save and save often. You never know when you're uh, when the game is gonna crash or when you're gonna lose power. Although, with the Switch, the only thing I'm concerned is the game crashing. That's it. Lose power, like, who gives a shit? It doesn't matter. Because it goes right to handheld mode. This is why I like doing Switch games for Let's Plays. If I can do it on the Switch, I'll do it on Switch. Now, these things, their mouths switch. Um, okay. And we obviously take more hits. Alright, I'm just gonna tell you what he's gonna say. He's gonna talk about this cube. Well, actually, no, he's not. Maybe after I strike it, but power up your sword like this, hit that cube. And now, somewhere in the map, you're gonna find that, um, there's a treasure chest that unlocked, and you can get that. I usually do that all the time. Um,. Because you get like heart pieces and other shit like that, so it's important to do that. And I may take some time to really grind at some point in this game, grind that out, and uh, and get all those. That's why I want to get the guide. I, I really want to see what happens if I get them all. And they're fun to get. It's not like boring or tedious or anything like that. It's just it's really fun to get them. So that's two right there, so there's two chests out in the main world that we can uh, unlock. And we're gonna get them some other time. I have to open this door up somehow, and I don't remember how to do it. The door is sealed shut. I don't remember how to unlock this door.
Uh, he who descends from above, look at the star that the bird uh, rise in heavenly. Okay. Okay, um, no, there's something up there. Where's the bird at gazing upon? Can't be this bird. Yeah, that's where we gotta go, obviously. Shit. Yeah, to get rid of them, you just gotta roll. Run and roll. Look at that, five bucks. I thought there was something that I have to hit. There's something there, but it's an item that you collect. Well, how the hell is Zelda get in? Um, here to send from above, look at the star that the bird rising and heavily gazes upon. So, uh, that's not the bird. It can't be the bird. Star. Oh, there's another one of those um, temple things up there. I see it. Oh, it's right here. Okay. <laughs> I was looking at all the wrong I was looking at all the wrong places. Uh, Skyview Temple. Uh, I'm gonna go. Yeah, I still got like 20 or 30 minutes I can go for tonight. Master, I have bad news. The arrows of many creatures river beat uh, through this temple. As a result, I can't isolate Zelda's Aurora. You're not be able to track her here. Well, I don't give two French fried titty fucks. Shut the fuck up. Let's go. Let's go. To play this on the Wii, you actually need, you need more than just a Wii Remote. I believe you need the Wii Motion Plus um, addition to it. Um, so you can either, I guess, buy that for your regular Wii Remote or buy a Wii Remote that you have already installed the Wii Motion Plus. Which I actually, yeah, I actually have that remote with me, actually. I use that to turn my Wii on and do GameCube games. I don't know how to have a nunchuck, so... <laughs> uh, for the most part, my Wii, I only play my Wii. Um, my Wii Wii I play it all the time. My Wii... Uh, mostly only play for um, GameCube games.
This eye's a little tricky, but let me kill everything in this room first. Well, oh, there's bats, right? <laughs> That's what I do, I got it. It's like Mario Brothers. Mario 64, when you run around that eyeball and get all dizzy and shit. Firecracker, goddamn. Okay, so I'm totally clueless. You know, as I mentioned, I don't have a player's guide for this yet, and if I do get one for this playthrough. It's going to be much, much, much later on. I have a few days till payday when I order it. By the time it ships and gets here, it could be the week after. So I could be just about done with the game or done with it all together, pretty much, before it gets here. Which is why I really want to hold off doing a Skyward Sword, but I couldn't help myself. Maybe I'll take my time playing it. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Um, I don't have a guide open either online. If I use a guide, it's probably going to be IGN. That's my go-to. Although I hate the fucking ads on it. Alright, maybe I can't go this way. I'm not going to fuck with it. I don't know what I'm doing. God damn it. I love The Legend of Zelda, my favorite all time video game franchise. Following that has to be like Madden or Grand Theft Auto, I can't really decide. Alright, so I'm guessing I don't go this way. Unless... I got lucky. I don't think I was supposed to do it that way. Two doors uh, lead to rooms left and right, but will only open one when a gemstone is struck. I know there's a door somewhere here. Well, I can't really go this way anyways. Oh, and it automatically saves too, just so you know. I'm gonna guess I have to go that way. I'm gonna have to open up a guide soon. I. Like, I don't want to struggle with games. This is only really my third time playing this dungeon. 
And I really don't have any idea what the fuck I'm doing. I'm not all that familiar with Skyward Sword. Oh, okay, there we go. I did not see this before. God damn it. And the water should raise. Yep, that I remember. Okay, I think it's time to switch my phone charger with my iPod charger. Or vice versa, other way. My phone doesn't get charged up at night. My friend's at the Philly. It's October. Philly's baseball. My friend's at the baseball game right now. The playoff game. He's sending me all these fucking snaps. And it's like, dude, it's close to bedtime. I'm ready to go to sleep. I have a game playing on my phone. And by the time this video comes out, has the Phillies win the World Series? Okay, so the water race here. Oh, I'm starting to feel it, guys. Did it raise out here? No, it did not. Oh, yes, it did. So what does that mean, though? Hold on, I got an idea. That didn't work. Stop doing that. Uh, so when I, went, when I go to select this item, all you gotta do is just tap the R button. I'm holding the R button, that's why the menu pops up, and I, I, it just annoys me a little bit. Yeah, we used the heart piece. Well, I can't, I can't go this way, can I? Like, I knew there was a door to the left, I couldn't find it, and there it is, there's something like a crawl through. This right here, I don't know what the fuck to do. We don't have a key, I don't think we have a key. Um... If we're gonna get the water to raise, I can jump up there. That's fucking cheap. So there's another way I can raise the water, but how do I do that? Wait a sec. There it is. How do I dive? Because I can't get that anymore. This game I pre-ordered from GameStop when it first came out on the, on the Switch a few years back. What was it last year? I can't remember when it was. Probably two years ago at this point. Year and a half. Um, and um, I got two posters that came with it. And they're both up on my wall. wall which I really like looking at them. Oh, we need these bad. They're really nice posters. How 
am I gonna break this? Hold still. Yeah. The L button. I'm never going to get used to that. Sorry. You have to time your swings right. Um, or else you're just gonna fall off. Well, it's not gonna swing right. And sometimes when it comes to these orange things, you're just gonna have to guess. Two glittering gemstones that shall find a temple map. Okay, we need a temple map. We could use a temple map. Reveals the location of treasure chest, so be sure to take a look. Master, I have information for you. You've retained the map of this area. You can do it by pressing blah blah blah. Shut up, don't talk. You're annoying. Oh my god, what? So, this is the first area. There's a chest in there. Bird statue there. Okay, we're gonna go back to the way we came. Or we we went in, I should say. Now, which which door was it over here? Cause there is something that we left in there. That. Well, that's risen. Risen or raisin? Raisin? No, raisins are fruit. Raisins are only good with like walnuts and shit, and peanuts and cashews, and maybe, maybe some M and M's mixed with it. Maybe I'm not crazy about M and M's mixed with my nuts. Alright, I'm gonna get my socks and get ready for bed. We're almost, we're almost done, so... We still have a key, but now the water's up pretty high. Did we go up here yet? I had to put my socks on and put my, um, put some lotion on my skin, because my skin really dries out. Like especially during the colder seasons, it dries the fuck out on my face. So I have to apply lotion after every every time after every time I shower, and I always forget to do that. But um, but I did it. Yeah, so we're almost done with the dungeon. This is a little strange because I don't know how to do it. We have to do both at the same time. 
Okay, I found the spot. It looks like... I gotta get that one spot. We got the key, now we can go back. Oh, and there's gonna be shit that I'm gonna miss. Which is fine. We still got this whole area right here to do. I thought maybe the end was right here, but it's not. We still got a little bit more of that to do. Um, but yeah, there's gonna be items I'm gonna miss, and I may end up coming back to these dungeons to get the chest, but... My main goal, I just wanna beat it. That's why we still get the, um, special item. Mini boss fight. Fucking dead? Thank you. <laughs> this game is way too generous with heart pieces. <laughs> I mean, I'll take it, but it's too generous. We got the beetle. This unexplained power contained uh, within the insect shape item allows you to control it as it flies through the air. So eventually we're going to get, we can upgrade some of these weapons and um, make these items more powerful. I don't think it's optional. I don't, I don't think it's a requirement. I think it's all optional. Um, but if I get the guide, I may um, end up looking at this shit and maybe upgrading it. I'm saying this now, but I'm gonna wait till I play like 20 hours of the game, then I'm gonna be too exhausted to fucking play <laughs> to do all that shit. I gotta fill these all these things that try to attack me. There's a heart piece there. How do I get it? There's something on that side that I have to hit. Which Hitting it here is not going to happen. I gotta go in the next room, so it's going to be a little bit. I think I'm trying to remember best I can.
the money out of that. It's a fairy in there, but I don't need the fairy. My bottle's a fool. Looks like my um, <laughs> my shield's just about gone. That's why I picked up two shields. I had a feeling I'm gonna end up going through both of them. Oh, the key is in one of these spots. I don't know how to do that. Did I go through this door yet? We're almost at max rubies. I, I gotta, I gotta, that's one thing I have to do is improve my wallet. I always try to do that in Zelda games. Ocarina of Time, forget it, just, just the one up, full upgrade and that's it. I can't do anything else because... Um, those, getting those gold skeletons are pretty fucking hard. Good time to uh, save it, and I can get ready for bed. Almost done with the dungeon. Almost done with the episode. I'm not going to do much. I'm just going to do the rest of the episode, and then I'm going to probably get those two um, goddesses stones that we activated, and I'm going to uh, probably call it quits there. But um, thank you so much for watching so far, guys. I truly appreciate all the support you've given me. Um, I love doing this shit for you guys, so... Let's resume some more Skyward Sword HD, baby. Alright, brand new day. <clears throat> brand new day. The cat's outside, that she ate. She won't be hearing her fucking meow. Thank God. You're meowing all fucking morning, man. Woke me up. I hate when she does that shit. Am I going the right way? This is the door that opened up, though, I think. Okay. <clears throat> Got some water in me. Where's my money? Uh. So some of the only food that I really have to eat for the next few days is um, chicken patties, and I really don't want to eat them right now. I'm really hungry though. I'm gonna do that. The, the, you know, the, uh, the school chicken patties and shit. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, there we go. Another water's pouring up. I bought a big gigantic bag. I should have bought more fucking buns though. What the hell? No, wait a second. What is... with the map? Okay, if I go that way... I gotta go this way, first. Get this chest. Activate all these things. 
put my phone right next to the computer so I can see it ring. I'm expecting a text message. I just don't know when because people don't really communicate very well with me. But how do I get them all to look at me? Wait, see that? Look at them. You only look at one direction. So how do I do this? Yeah, they all gotta be at once. Which I don't. Mm, up here. Okay. <laughs> no, fucker, come on. No, I don't know where to push this to exactly. Tricky, you just gotta look behind you and climb up those vines. You really don't think that way, do you? Well, I don't. at the max. He's actually going to do it. Okay, so we have a key now. I'm going to guess the door over here. That, that's why I just, I didn't go around the first time, because there's, there's no way you can make that turn sharp enough. There's no point going down for that money. Absolutely no fucking point. This one's a little tricky. You gotta hit them all at the same time. Didn't do it. Come on, dude. Seriously? There we go.
Goodbye, Mr. Spider. <clears throat> He's dead. He's dead, boys. Oh, fucker. <laughs> ah, they can never get over how funny that is. This is probably money. Yeah. Put it back. Oh, no, we don't put the money back. That's bullshit. Seriously? Do I not get it from jumping? Oh, yes, I do. Alright, well, that doesn't make any sense. I fell the first time. Juice. The juice is not loose, boys. It's not loose. Oh, but that works. Okay. Um, I don't think I hit these from here, do I? Strangely shaped gold sculpture is covered in mysterious patterns and semen. Okay, now we're talking. I, of course, I'll take this part. Now, I think there's a switch somewhere in this building, or in this room, that opens up that gate to the heart piece room. I thought there was. I could be wrong. Well, for... Wait, no. Hold on a second, because that's where the boss is. go there just yet. Oh, well, he's not there. Okay, I thought there was a, a tunnel or something. Go back towards the uh Oh 
Oh, I know it's here somewhere. I just don't know where it's at exactly. I'm just gonna look online, fuck it. Because I don't, I don't want to come back here for that heart piece, but I want to get it now. A quick question. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say, what's this temple's name? Skyview Temple Heart Piece. There's one heart piece. After you exit the structure, when you receive the beetle, head north to the side of the tower, face south, and see a heart container on a cage at ground level. At the top of the tower is a purple switch. Okay, oh, it's right above it. I thought it was in this room. My bad, boys. Oh. 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 Shut up, Link. Well, I don't see a purple thing above it. Maybe it's up here. Okay. Okay. Hey! There we go. Alright, it's boss fight time. This guy's a little tricky, this boss. And I really have no idea how to, uh... How to get him. Did I get that heart piece? I think I did. My brother sent me a text message. He's pissed me off now. Alright, get in there. Come on. This is fucking stupid. There we go, the H, as in Triple H. Sort away. Look who it is. If it isn't my arch nemesis, Jimmy Anal. I thought that tornado I stirred up would have tossed you and torn you apart, but here you are, not in pieces. Not that your life or death has any consequence. Yeah, 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 yeah. To the girl that matters now, and I can sense her here, just beyond this door. Yes, we plucked her majesty from the perch in the clouds, and now she's ours. Oh, but listen to me. I'm being positively uncivil. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Bits and Glory. Blah, 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 blah. Nah. I'm a demon lord who presides over this land you look down upon. This world you call the surface. You may call me... I don't even know how to fucking pronounce that. The Big G. In truth, I much prefer to be indulged in my full title. Lord G. Or oh, LG. I am not fussy.
All right, we're gonna fight and we're gonna fuck. Did you really destroy your sword? Foolish boy. I may have to look online to learn how to fight this guy. We're all right, so the girl should have fallen in our hands already. She was nearly ours in that loathsome service when the goddess snatched her away. Do you have any idea how that made me feel inside? Furious! Outrage! Sick of anger! This turn of events has left me with a strong appetite for bloodshed. Still, it hardly seems fair being in my position to take all my anger out on you. Come on, stop being weird. Which is why I promised up front not to murder you. No, I'll just beat you within an inch of your life. Oh. I'll swing that way, dude. Or are you a chick? I don't know who you are. You're, you're fucking weird, though. No, you definitely do. Maybe, I don't know. I don't care. I don't care this thing. Alright. Oh. Am I hitting him? Oh! Oh! Oh shit! Oh, now he knows all my moves? What? Get the fuck off me, bitch. Come on, stop being weird! Fucking attack! Blue lady, help me. Master, your wallet is full. You'll be able to kill us. Th that's what you're fucking worried about? That's not fair. Ah, a lucky son of a bitch. Yeah, yeah snap your fingers. Go ahead. to do.
shit. Alright, read you easier than a book. And I can't even read. Come on, I'll die already. Finally. Finally, he's dead. Well, you put up more than a fight that I would have thought possible out of the soft boy. But don't clap yourself quite yet. That sort of is the only reason you still live. <clears throat> I fear I spent far too long teasing and toying with you. The girl's presence all has been faded from this place, which means there's no reason to linger here. Oh, sorry. I thought I did. Whatever. I don't care. I hate reading. Alright, so we beat be this bad guy with my harpies. <laughs> Like my heart piece. We got a heart container. <clears throat> Sorry, my throat gets a little clogged up more in the mornings. Now before we do that um, sword striking thing, yeah, I knew there was one back here. I remember there being one back here, and you always come back to this spot later on to uh, hit that. It's very easily missable. Um, now that I have an empty bottle, I can take one of these fairies, right? I don't want fucking water. There we go. So power up the sword and swing. And this blue thing's gonna talk to you for an hour. Master, I have a message written in the language of the gods of old. Allow me to translate for you. Oh, please don't. I'm not. I'm not reading this, guys. I got the ruby tablet. Mother, 
Master, to just translate and repeat that Zelda purified herself in the waters of the spring. Oh yeah, I found out a 97.23 and a half percent chance that she has already set for, for Elden, which is another great spring exists. Okay, I hate this fucking blue thing. Stop talking to me! Uh-oh. Hey, it's me, Queen. Did you find the girl? Who are you? What do you mean, who am I? Don't tell me you forgot the old buddy M. Now I'm sad. Hey, good. Leave me fucking alone then. I'm so glad I finally reunited with all my K friends. It's all thanks to you. Could we? Thank you a lot. Hopefully you'll find that girl. Blah, 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 blah. See, totally pointless. Get the fuck away from me. Leave me alone. It's unnecessary talking in this game. Okay, so let's save it real quick. Let's go to the sky and let's hit these, um... Let's hit these, um, other... Um, cubes that... Well, let's get the cube items that we hit. Don't we'll call it quits for the episode. Yeah. Uh, Master Jimmy, we need to that goddess cube with the Skyward Strike earlier, I was able to detect the results in energy. Yeah, I know all about this. There's two on that island right there. So we're gonna put one there. We hit three. Oh, wait. Where's the rest of them at? I don't have any more cubes. Well, let's go to this one first then. Fuck it. I advise you to shut the fuck up too, bitch. So shut up. I guess in this island right here. Oh wait, how do I jump out the fucking bird? God damn it, just jump off the fucking bird! I have no idea how to do that. Holy moly! I think it was the R button. <laughs> ah, good. One more heart container. I'm glad it's three in this game and not five like Twilight Princess. Oh, money is useless, that's right. Alright, bird. Is the right trigger button. Oh, good. We got an extra adventure pouch, so we can fit another item in, which is great. Okay, there's one more here. I will save it. Oh, no, I won't save it right now, because I'll come back and I'll save it. No, I don't know where this cube is at. Is 
is it below me? It could be inside the pumpkin place too. There's a heart piece in here we gotta get we can get that we have to break. Um that thing up there. Okay, are we done? Are we done looking? Yeah, we're done looking, right? Are we wasting my time some more? Okay. Try I can't use items in this place, because I will use my fucking bug thing. Don't talk to me, please. Thank you. Why would you do that? Get down here and come in this instant. I will come. I'll come hard. Now, bro, you have a treasure chest in here somewhere that I'm looking for. Thanks, bro. I don't really care what you have to say, dude. Hey now! Oh come on man. Seriously, leave me the fuck alone! What's wrong with this? Look at what you've done. You broke my fancy custom water chain blue. You're gonna be working hard. Just whatever. That's right, I'm gonna hold you to that. It's not wasting any time, I need you to deliver. Oh Jesus Christ. Yeah, I don't have an empty bottle, so get the fuck away from me. Seriously. Leave me the fuck alone. Give me an empty bottle and I'll deliver it. If not, leave me the fuck alone. Thank you. <laughs> Maybe this guy should do the uh, Jimmy A approach to uh, not having little kids come into his fucking bar and shit. Right there, here it is. I was wondering where it was. Oh, come on. I was gonna say, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, god damn it! God damn it! <sighs> well, boy, that's gonna do it for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Social media, you know, my. Rank 1 Global account if you want to see what I think of my games that I play currently on the channel. Um, it's up there, YouTube bio, Discord, YouTube bio, Twitter, YouTube bio, Instagram, you want to see my gaming collection, YouTube bio. Check it all out, guys. Uh, we're going to do more in part two, obviously. Stay tuned for that, and I will see you next time. Thank you, have a good day.